Hey guys, this is Chris Vinson out here at JMAT RV in Poto, Oklahoma. I'm sitting inside of our air conditioned uh, showroom, beating the heat out there. Uh, come on out here, look at some of our campers. This is the perfect place to look at them uh, in. Do want to show you a quick video. This is uh, one of our brand new Sprinter 326 FWBHS uh, fifth wheel camping trailers. I'm not going to be able to get to everything on this trailer in this video. Just I do want to show you some of the high points on the outside and the inside. So uh, let's get started. Uh, right off the bat, this is an all weather camping trailer. We do, you can tell by the thickness of these doors, uh, really well insulated. And these are slam latch baggage doors, so really nice feature there. Uh, right here is all of our connections. So we have our hot and cold outdoor shower. We have our water connection, our water fill, our uh, black tank flush. Even uh, cable and satellite connections are in there. Make that makes that real convenient. Okay, guys. Now we're on the back side of uh, the camping trailer. You can see we have our rear outdoor kitchen. So we have a grill here that swings out away from the bumper. Uh, it makes that uh, uh, real convenient to carry. We do have a stove top that will fold up and go in out of the way. So you have two cooking surfaces: a uh, uh, stove top and a grill. Uh, even have an, has an outdoor hot and cold sink, lots of storage all the way around, and of course one of the most important things, we have a refrigerator out here. So if you're, if you're thirsty, you don't have to go in and out and in and out uh, for your drinks. You can keep them right here. Uh, down below, let me show you one thing down here. This is pretty neat. This is a uh, called the toy lock, and it's basically like a big bicycle chain, 15 foot, and you can uh, if you have a bicycle or a, a ice chest or something that you don't want stolen at the campground, you can lock that into your trailer. So, really neat feature there. Up over here, we do have our power uh, electric awning. Just hit the button that comes in and out. You can see we do have the LED awning lights already on this camping trailer. Uh, right up here, I talked to you about the construction of this, the all-weather. Uh, this is performance tested at zero degrees and at 100 degrees. And what that means is uh, they have a facility where they can control the temperature. They take the temperature down to zero degrees uh, for 24 hours. They have the furnace running and this camper for 24 hours will hold 72 degrees. Then they take the temperature up to 100 degrees and with the air conditioners in here they hold 72 degrees for 24 hours at 100 degrees. So it's a really well insulated large air conditioners, large furnace, uh, all-weather camping trailer. It's also a wide body camping trailer uh, and what that one of the big benefits that gives you is the fresh water tank. If you want to take water with you, you can take 87 gallons. So that's quite a bit of water uh, if you're doing some dry camping. Well, let's go inside and look around. Well guys, we're back here in the bunk room now. Uh, as you can see, we got a couple of bunk beds on this side. We have a sofa over here on this side and you can sit here uh, hook up your TV here to the connections and the kids can watch TV or play games uh, if they need to. Lots of storage. But on this uh, sofa, that does come down when you need it to sleep more. It makes a really large, nice bed there. Then, of course, you got another bunk above. So quite a bit of sleeping back here in this uh, bunk room area. Right outside the bunk room, we have an extra large storage. That is just about as big of indoor storage as you can get. If you look, you have the washer dryer connections, and even if you put a stackable washer dryer in there, you still got a ton of space to, for pantry or closet or however you want to use it. So just a lot of extra storage. Uh, this, I said this was a wide-bodied camper. These slides are actually 42 inches deep. Extra, extra deep slide, six foot three. So it's uh, six foot three inches tall and 42 inches deep slides so really really opens it up in here uh, this dining booth is actually 48 inches so if you did need to make a secondary bed here uh, this booth uh, will make a really wide uh, wide body bed speaking of sofa when you got your sofa this will also make a bed and uh, this is a very large bed and very easy to take out and i'm going to show you real quick how easy that is So it's just that easy. Uh, really makes a large, just about a queen size bed here. So two people could easily sleep right here. Well, let's me make it back real quick. Okay guys, 
Up here at the front, we do have our large 40-inch LED uh, screen television. And this does come out an angle for whoever need, wants or needs to see it. Uh, down below, we do have a, uh, uh, it's hard to see down in there, but we do have a sound bar. Uh, so that'll give you that really rich sound uh, when you're watching movies or TV here. Below that, we have our electric fireplace. So uh, right now, there's no heat coming out of it. But uh, if you need it to, this is like a space heater and that uh, will warm up this whole bottom area. It puts out quite a bit of heat actually. Uh, in here in the kitchen area, just gonna start right here, this really extra large uh, residential refrigerator. We do have three uh, separate bottom drawer freezer, uh, three door, and uh, this is a, again, a residential refrigerator. It will run going down the road. This trailer does have an inverter. So as you're going down the road, making a big long trip, it will still run. So a uh, real, real neat feature there. Uh, full oven, uh, three burner stove top, microwave, and tons of storage. Look at this storage. Just a lot of storage up here above uh, for all your spices or whatever you need. Do have a high rise faucet with a pull out uh, uh, sprayer. A split 60-40 sink, and this operates as a cutting board if you need it to. And then over here we have uh, our uh, real wood drawers on uh, roller bearing guides. So come on up into the bathroom, let's look in there. Okay, inside the bathroom, one of the big features I want to point out is we do have uh, storage. So uh, there's no more uh, storing your towels or washcloths in the bedroom or somewhere else. You can actually put everything in here in the bathroom. Uh, down here, we do have a residential height uh, toilet, and that is porcelain. So, uh, really neat feature there. We got our uh, our shower insert. Does have a bench there, so the ladies can sit there and and uh, shave their legs. Has a skylight, and then over here we have our uh, vanity storage underneath, sink, and medicine cabinet. Well, let's go on inside to the bedroom. Okay guys, now we're inside the bedroom. We have a full bedroom slide here and that gives us our queen size bed. And uh, one of the neat features here is we do have a lot of, a lot of good storage underneath that bed right there. Uh, at the foot of the bed, we have this dresser with uh, multiple sizes drawers, but there's a, a total of seven drawers here. Right here, if you want to, you can put you a big uh, big TV, and there's your TV connections. This has both uh, cable and satellite connections downstairs and up in the bedroom. And then at the front, we do have a huge closet all the way across the front end and then storage on either side of it. And one more really neat thing about this, uh, this, this uh, camping trailer, I mentioned it outside about the, being all weather. This does have two air conditioners, one in the bedroom and the main one downstairs. Uh, this has got extra, extra air uh, just to keep you more comfortable. So, well guys, I wasn't able to get to everything on this camping trailer, but please give me a call. You can call me toll free at 888-293-2211